So I've just I've just had a haircut, a haircut and a shave and a neck and head massage. Free right, it's a free right. <coughs> and normally it would only be like 20 pesos for the shave and 40 for the haircut, but I always give them 80. I know I'm I'm so generous on it. <laughs> But it's it's lovely, it really is. And normally I wouldn't let them use that. They use a blade, not as like you know, a proper shaver like we'd use in the UK. But I've never been cut once. It's brilliant. So and I always get my hair cut like this because it's easy to manage. <laughs> so I've had a thought. I've been thinking about the bank and the money transfer and I was thinking if my friend Adrian was coming to the Philippines and Connie I'm quite sure he would uh, do a bank transfer for the money I have and uh, get the money off me when I when he come here but being as they're probably not coming here for the next eight months I don't think you'd do something like that but having said that, the uh, exchange rate's going down. So I'm imagining that um, it's going to be quite low because he, Adrian and Connie bought two lots of land in the Philippines. And when they paid for the land, the ex, uh, exchange, not exchange, yeah, exchange rate was... Um, I think it was 64, 65 pesos. And at the moment, it's about 73. So, if I'd have had the money at the time, it would have, been, it would have benefited him to uh, transfer the money into my account because he'd have got more for his money. So, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I mean, what I've been doing is living, living on the money and I'm not having to transfer to the UK, so the bank account builds up in the UK. But the problem is, everybody knows I have it, and it's difficult. For example, I lent a thousand, well, oh, I shouldn't say. It's all for them, this, this place. Hold on a minute, mate. For example, I lent, um, not close family, but a family member some money a while ago few months ago she said she'd pay it back in a month the month come she says oh I'm sorry I, I'll pay it back next month I've not been paid then the next month come oh I'm sorry I'll pay it next month then the next month come and she just gave up and I'm not getting the money back basically so the moral of that story is do not borrow anything whether it's money power drills anything because you will be sorry don't show what you have right? well but you have I know. I know. Just so for them this is the place that we live in Mary. Oh yeah, this is this is the shop where we I got my shirt from and Mel got a dress from. They're very obliging, as are most Filipinos actually. So I'm just gonna draw some money because I owe my baby some money. And she's lent me for that honey. Flip -flops. Yeah. So I've gone through no end of flip flops while I've been here. So I decided to bring it to this young man. Brand new flip flops and he's actually sewn them and strengthened them so they can't break. So they've lasted a long time. Which is great because they're not a lot of money flip flops here but if you go through a lot of them it, it all mounts up. So what now, baby? We go. Pure gold. Pure gold. Right. Yeah, pure gold is where we have to go to get the Western <coughs> Union transfer. My cough's getting better. My blood pressure's still about the same. It's a little bit lower. But once I get on this juicing diet, last time I did this juicing diet, me. The weight just dropped off me and my blood pressure went down to normal. Well, normal for my age anyway. Um, now, I want to thank everybody for their comments. 
Now I know I'm fat and I know that's partly the reason why I've got high blood pressure. Obviously I know that. <laughs> so basically that's why I'm doing the, uh, the juicing. And uh, it's amazing how fast the weight drops off. So remember my big fat belly on the video on the balcony you've seen and give it another four weeks six weeks and that belly will be gone not totally <laughs> it's never be gone totally but it'll be uh, a lot better but and then soon we will rebuild the gender of the baby Different oh yeah months. yeah how many months six or five five, five months yeah so what is your guess is it we're, we're four months at the moment aren't we so we're four months and we're going for a scan in five months. Now that's funny because I had this conversation with Mel before and I says, are you going in five months? She says, no, six. Now she's saying five months. Oh, she's excited, she wants to go early. Now, one of her um, cousins had a baby. Everybody was saying a boy. She went for the scan. They said it's a girl. You what, baby? You're, you're doing that over there. Yeah, go on. Alright, calm down. Um, and the scan said it were a girl. But when she actually had the baby, it turned out it was a boy. Scans don't always uh, tell the truth, obviously. But now, when I'm pregnant, now it's different than when I'm not cute. Right, now the difference now is, with your pregnancy, is one, you're not as big as before at this point. And two, you're not eating like you did with Matthew. You never stopped eating, did you? Yeah, and then now I feel sick. And now you feel bad. You've had you've had sickness this time, which you didn't have with Matthew. Morning sickness. Yeah. Matthew, no. Yeah, and I mean really thrown up. She was really quite poorly. Um, with Matthew, there was no sickness, nothing. We're hoping it's a girl this time. So give your thoughts on that. What do you think, girl, boy? I'm thinking it's a girl this time, I'm hoping so. Don't assume. Don't assume? Okay. Mel wants you to tell her what you think it's going to be. What's your guess? What do you think the scan's going to reveal, Mel? Girl or boy? Girl or boy? No, I'm asking you, babe. What do you think? Girl. Girl, yeah. Yeah. You see, see this? I'm hungry. The begging. That's about it. I'm going back back to our bike. Got my money, got my hair cut, got the honey I wanted. Yeah. Well, both honeys. I've got Mel, she's my honey. But I've got some sweet honey as well. Not that she's not sweet, are you, baby? Everybody's running for the bucket now, Mel. <laughs> That's it, guys. I'll buy ano, mais. You'll buy ano? Corn. Corn. We have changed. No. Mm, so day. that's it then, Mel. Over please, to you. Please hit the like button and please subscribe and share us. Sh don't share us. Share, share our videos. Share our videos. <laughs> Bye, Thank guys. Bye. Bye. Searching for a longer day People feeling like the light has just come We must never stop the way Birds chirping and I hear my name Grasping